Welcome to this prayer of transformation and spiritual breakthrough. Today, we're diving deep into the power of God's word to unlock divine favor in your life. If you've been searching for a shift, for a new level of spiritual awakening, you're in the right place. This is a moment to let God's power flow into every area of your life. Let's start by reflecting on Jeremiah 29, 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and a future. This verse is a beacon of hope, reminding us that God's plans are not just good, they are designed with your future in mind. Despite whatever challenges you may face, God's intention is to bring you into a place of prosperity, hope, and divine purpose. The significance of this verse lies in its promise that God is always working for your good. When you surrender to His plans, you align yourself with His divine blueprint for your life, a blueprint that is filled with hope, a future, and overwhelming favor. But before we dive into this prayer, let's take a moment to surrender our lives fully to Christ. This is where true transformation begins. If you haven't already, or if you feel the need to rededicate your life to Him, I invite you to pray this simple prayer with me. Lord Jesus, I come before you today acknowledging that I need you in my life. I repent of my sins and ask for your forgiveness. I believe that you died for me and rose again to give me new life. Today I surrender my heart, my plans, and my life to you. Come into my heart and be my Lord and Savior. In your precious name I pray, amen. Now that we've surrendered our lives to Christ, let's enter into this powerful prayer together. Close your eyes, quiet your mind, and let's approach the throne of grace. Heavenly Father, we come before you today with hearts open and minds ready to receive. We know that you have plans for our lives that are good and filled with hope. Lord, we ask that you would reveal those plans to us, even now as we pray. Father, we thank you for your word in Jeremiah 29 11. We declare that your plans for us are good and we align ourselves with your will. We ask for your divine favor to be released in every area of our lives. May your hand of blessing be upon our families, our careers, our health, and our relationships. As we journey through this prayer, Lord, let your Holy Spirit fill us with joy, peace, and strength. We bind every spirit of doubt, fear, and confusion, and we release your power and authority over our circumstances. Father, let this be a time of breakthrough. Where there has been lack, we speak abundance. Where there has been pain, we speak healing. Where there has been despair, we speak hope. Lord, we ask that you would transform us from the inside out. Change our hearts to reflect your love, our minds to reflect your wisdom, and our spirits to reflect your strength. We want to be more like you, Jesus, in everything we do. I let this time of prayer be a time of refreshing. Renew our spirits, recharge our faith, and reignite our passion for you. We declare that we are stepping into a new season, a season of favor, breakthrough, and divine alignment with your perfect will. Father, as we continue to pray, let your presence saturate every corner of our lives. May we sense your peace, your guidance, and your love surrounding us. We pray for the courage to walk boldly in the plans you have for us, knowing that you are with us every step of the way. As we bring this prayer to a close, I encourage you to revisit this time of prayer daily. Let these words soak into your spirit and meditate on them, knowing that God's plans for you are full of hope and a future. Each time you return to this prayer, Expect God to reveal more of His will for your life, to strengthen your faith, and to lead you deeper into His love. Thank you for joining me in this powerful time of prayer. Remember, God's plans for you are beyond what you can imagine. Stay aligned with Him and watch His divine favor unfold in your life. May God bless you abundantly as you continue to walk in His ways. Amen.